Okay, so here we are watching my mother's antique coffee pot percolate coffee. It starts off with cold water in the bottom section and there's a tube in that hopper and then you just put your loose ground coffee in the hopper. As the water heats it comes up the tube and it percolates as it's doing right now. Now the coffee we use in this is regular drip coffee. You can't really buy the old percolator coffee anymore so we don't need to percolate it very long. And if we shut it off As uh, a vacuum is created in the bottom, it's going to suck the water back into the coffee pot. And there's a kind of a little metal filter in the bottom of the hopper which will catch the coffee grounds. Once it starts going down, it goes all of a sudden. We're out camping on the long weekend and this is the coffee pot we use when we're camping in uh, in our small camper trailer. My mother got this coffee pot about 60 years ago or more than 60 years ago. Oh yeah, it'd be more than 60 years ago. Uh, and at the time it was restaurant service. Restaurants all over used this type of coffee pot. And I'm going to run out of battery, probably, so we may not see the uh, the coffee go down. Oh, there it goes. And you hear the last bit of suction as it goes down to the bottom and there's your coffee grounds in the hopper. So now it's just a matter of removing the hopper and closing the lid in the coffee pot and enjoying your brew. In our case we're going to be enjoying it with Bailey's in a few minutes. Bye for now.